Hello everyone. All right, so today I'm gonna to be doing a quick review on, hold on, let's see if I can hold the tablet correctly while I show you. Well, here, I'll just show you. This right here, the Bespoke uh, Vacuum Jet. If you see I'm sweating already and glistening in the light, that is because I've been building shelves and I'm sweating and I've been trying to clean up around the place. So my floors are trashed um, because I built two shelves, one of which is right there and I have another over here. So I'm hot, I'm sweaty, perfect time to keep cleaning. If you hear noise in the background, that is the washing machine and doing some laundry. So this weekend is a cleaning weekend. So good time to review this vacuum cleaner. Um, this video is mostly for Brie. Brie has been asking me to do a <laughs> review on this vacuum cleaner. She wants to buy one. I've already bought one. Um, I clean a lot. Uh, regularly when it comes to vacuuming because I have a dog she just shook and hair just went everywhere I have a dog who sheds like crazy um, and um, so I vacuum probably every other day and still does not seem like enough um, it's been about four days since I vacuumed last maybe less um, then there are hairballs all over the place because <laughs> she's a high shedding dog um, and it's summertime in Arizona so she's shedding um, so this vacuum cleaner will be put to great use and I will show you and her, Brie, um, the intricate parts of the vacuum, why I think it's so great. I went through four Samsung vacuum cleaners this month, um, just testing them all out, seeing which one was great. I tried the Roomba, it sucked. Um, it's cool, like it has like, um, it has a, what's it called, LiDAR, LiDAR system, so you can actually map out your whole place. Um, the, the dang thing wouldn't leave the one spot. It kept going in circles for like 20 minutes. So it couldn't get from underneath the coffee table. <clears throat> and it's a big coffee table. So I was like, forget it, screw it. Returned it. Uh, bought a, a, one similar to this, the Jet one. Um, and it was only like three or $400. So I bought that. That one was good. I liked it, which is why I wanted to upgrade it. But um, the three or $400 vacuum was a little underpowered, I would say. Um, so I went ahead and went with the most expensive, comes with the stand, comes with an extra charger, um, or battery pack, I should say, and, uh, and it has way more suction, a lot more suction. So um, I'm happy with this purchase so far. And, um, but what was crazy, I went to buy it, it was like $899 here in the US. And the same day I bought it, the next day it went on sale and I, it was $100 less. I hadn't even taken it out of the box because it hadn't even arrived yet. So I asked Samsung, hey, can you just give me the $100 credit so I can have it for $7.99? Uh, and they basically told me I have to return it, buy it again, so I can get it at the cheaper price. That's some crap. So as soon as it arrived, I took it right back down to go get it shipped, had it shipped, and um, bought it again. So now, if you go online now, this is, uh, what day is this today? July 23rd? Today's July 23rd. They're still on sale for $7.99. So if you want one, now's a good time to get it because they're $100 cheaper, okay? Uh, and I'll put like my Samsung like code. I think there's a Samsung code you can put, you can use as like a referral code. You guys can use that. I think it's like five, 10% off or something off of all Samsung products. So if you want, go use it. I don't know if it's a first come, first serve. It's just there if you want to use it. Um, let me go towel off because I'm sweating. It's hot here in Arizona um, and, and cleaning with all the windows open. Um, let me go towel off and then I'll get into this quick review of this uh, vacuum cleaner, okay? All right, so first things first, uh, let me just introduce you to it. So this is the bespoke Samsung Jet vacuum cleaner. Um, don't mind the floors. Like I said, I haven't vacuumed in a few, <laughs> few days um, and it's time to clean. So anyways, so um, it comes with, uh, the most expensive one comes with this um, wet spinner, the, the spinner system, this one right here. That one is an extra $120, I believe. Everything else it'll come with, like these head brushes. Here, let me just turn it to the side. You get he extra head brushes um, and you get a, an extra battery on the back. So that way it'll last longer. Um, it also comes with this beautiful stand. This is in white. There's two other colors. You can pop open this part um, and when it opens, it has like a trash bag. So when you get done cleaning, you can empty out the trash bag. But, so let me take off this so you can see. It's hard to do one-handed. So here's the vacuum, right? And you attach the piece back here into it, which I'll do in a second. And then on the screen, so this is the screen right here. This is on medium already. 
and you can kind of see stuff spinning around there a little bit. It tells you how much time you have and it will count down the minutes for you. Um, obviously going into higher power. And it will tell you how much time you have left on each one. So at the maximum speed, like the jet speed, um, you get like a couple minutes, right? You get like three or four minutes of, of jet speed. So I guess for those hard to, hard to handle places. But um, it also, the stand is a charger as well. You see the light just came back on. Um, so I will maybe kind of, I'll see if I can do this one handed with, <laughs> with the tablet and I'll try to clean some. All right, so I got it attached. It is a telescoping uh, vacuum, so it goes up and down like in size for short people, tall people. Um, and it is a quick, easy snap uh, as far as like snapping it into place. And it has really good suction. So like here's a lot of the stuff I have as far as debris goes from me cleaning and building some shelves. There's some like styrofoam on the carpet. And it does a great job picking up everything. And then you can see it in here. All right, so I just got done uh, finishing vacuuming my place. And Brie, this is the coolest part of the video, which is, and probably the coolest part of the vacuum, obviously, but is the suction. So when this, and you're ready to empty out the tray uh, or the container that fills up with all the dog hair and dirt from cleaning up your place, you just hit the button. Boom, and it's clean. So it'll do that for probably uh, 10, 15 seconds. And then all the air that it sucks out of the vacuum and it, there's like a filtration system down here, like a HEPA filter system. So the air it's blowing out is supposed to be purified and clean and all that stuff. So it's not just blowing back out your, your trash out of the container. All right, so fast forwarding into the next day. Uh, so today is now the 24th. I'm gonna try to use the spin brush. Um, it's, does, it does not have any suction. So it's not gonna suck up any dirt or debris, but it does come with these, um, which are disposable wet cloths. These are reusable um, cloths. And then I guess some, I don't know what these pads are for, maybe sort of like buff, buffering or buffing, whatever the word is. Um, so I'm gonna try to attach those onto here, see how well it works, and uh, give my review on that. But um, what I was surprised was that according to the commercials and advertising it did have like this water container that was like right here that you could fill with water and when i received it obviously it does not and instead they give these now so kind of a little bit of mis um misinformation or false advertising i think but we'll give it a try see how it works and um like i said i think in the beginning of my video i said that this was about 120 dollars i believe or 130 dollars um, so yeah, just be, be mindful that it does not come with the overall jet vacuum system. This is a separate purchase. All right. So I do have these attached. They're not as wet as I expected them to be. Um, I don't, I don't know how much surface area these are going to cover with how wet they are. So we'll see if you have to go through multiples of these. I don't know. Uh, but it is pretty thick, uh, thicker than I was expecting. I was trying to peel them apart, but I guess they are all, uh, in one, it looks like it's three or four layers. Um, but it's just one. That's how thick they are. Uh, and I will say that they do smell good too. So when you open the package, it does smell very clean uh, and it does have a scent. Okay, so I might've done that wrong. Within three seconds of me turning it on, it did spin and they flew right off. So I guess they did not attach very well. So maybe I'm doing something wrong. Let me read the instructions. So now what I've done is I've attached it to these buffer, but see, they still are very, they're not, they don't stick on here very well. I'll still give it a try, but the bottom part sticks very well um these i thought they were like um buffing pads but i guess they just help to like keep these on or those on um we'll see i'm not i'm not impressed with these so far all right so i do take it back um the pads do stay on fairly well once you use the pad underneath uh they are only pretty much good for like one room so like you would need to use multiple disposable wet cloths if you're planning on doing multiple, like I was only able to do my kitchen area, 
I still have like my bathroom, my hallway, my bar area that I still need to do. So the, I'll probably end up going through like maybe three of these, three or four of these. Um, I don't think it's a good replacement for a mop because one, a mop I think is just going to be way faster. It's it's a it's a nice substitute if you need to like clean up something pretty quick. Um, this was what it collected in just my my kitchen. Um, mind you, I haven't mopped in like a while, y'all. So this is actually. Um, uh, like I said, it's a, it's a quick fix basically, but I, I think I would still rather mop on top of this and then maybe go back over it with this or these could last longer if you add some water or some kind of moisture on the ground itself or the ground, the floor. Um, like if you put water and some pine saw down or something, I don't know, maybe these will last a little bit longer and, and make it last more rooms. 